do you keep on acting like a fool? You don't know it's me, not you. And if you didn't know it, girl, it's you. Then they put your feet to the Try to understand why he is a part of my life. And no, it's killing you Girl Gladys, aka Is That Your Hair, and welcome back to my channel. Welcome to Twenty Dollar Tuesdays. Twenty Dollar Tuesdays is a time where I show you super cute and super affordable wigs for twenty dollars and below. So let's get into it. All right, so today I have a wig from the Janet Collection, and the name of this wig is Maggie. Maggie does come with your typical cap construction, with your two combs here in the front a comb in the back with adjustable straps. This is not a lace front wig, it is a lace part wig. So there's only lace where the lace parting is here. Now, before we dive into the pros, I just wanted to give a huge thank you to everyone that participated in my 3K giveaway. The winner will be announced tomorrow on my story. So if you participate in the giveaway, make sure you watch my stories on Instagram tomorrow. That's Wednesday, October 30th, to find out if you won the giveaway. If you did win the giveaway, make sure you DM me as soon as possible so that I can figure out what wig you want and I can send it to you ASAP. All right, so on to the pros of this wig. The first pro has to be the color, y'all. Look at this glorious color. I tried to include some close-up shots of the color. So the color is called violet blue and that's exactly what it looks like. It looks like a mixture of violet and blue. Oh my God, it is gorgeous. This is a beautiful color. I haven't had a wig this color yet. The color, A+. It is dark rooted pretty much throughout the wig, right? It looks like it's dark, dark rooted almost throughout the wig, so I can appreciate that. I love how they did the dark rooting up here and how it just gradually, and how it just gradually blends into the violet blue color. Perfect job, Janet Collection. I do like the style of this wig. I do like the style of this wig. It's very sleek, very nice. I think the color looks even more vibrant in a sleek style like this. Like you can see the dimensions of the color. Look at that. <laughs> this wig falls on me, let's say, past my breast. So definitely like about 20 inches or so. Let me give you a quick 360 of the unit. As far as the texture, I would say it's a light yakky texture. It feels really smooth, almost like a silky texture, but there's, you feel that little bit of yakiness in it, which I'm really glad, because I don't like silky texture straight wigs. I just don't, especially when they're synthetic. Don't like it. Right now, I'm not getting any tangling or shedding, but this is synthetic and it's under $20. I don't expect too much for the price point. I can already tell though that it's gonna tangle quite a bit, especially at the nape area. Just be mindful of that if you decide to purchase this wig. Y'all, I really like this unit. I just like it for the color. Like I think the color is absolutely gorgeous. So as far as the cons to this wig, the main con was just the construction here. As you saw in the beginning, I had to do some work. I had to cut a V in the front. I also had to snip off um, the tracks in the front that were poking out as well. There is still a little track trying to poke through here and I'll probably get at that later when I get to a mirror. But I feel like I did a good job making it look as natural as it possibly can. When you have wigs that are a lace part wig, which means that there's no lace to cut, there's gonna be a line of demarcation. That's why I always suggest the cutting of the V and the lace. And I've done it a few in a few of my videos now, but hopefully you saw in the beginning what I'm talking about. If not, just make sure you want to the beginning because it's right there. Cut that little V and it will blend seamlessly. That was the main con. Yes, this looks good, y'all. The price is always gonna be a pro. I got this for $17.49 on GlamourTrust.com. I believe she is still on there. I've seen someone else review her in like this um, ash blonde color, which was beautiful. I would love to try that color as well. But this is a, this is a nice buy. $17? And you get this type of dimension and color? Come on, y'all. Like, this is amazing. This is what I like about synthetic wigs. I like the fact that me being a person who loves trying different colors, I don't have to worry about bu buying 613 bundles and 
you know, getting like violet and blue and putting them together in a mixing bowl and trying to achieve this color. With the synthetic wig, it is done for you. So you can just, you know, plop it on, make your little adjustments and go. Now, if you wanna know about how to dye a synthetic wig, I have a video on that too. I dyed um, the wig Chrissy by Sensational from the Wet Lace Collection. I dyed that pink and a lot of you seem to like it. I think I'll do that again maybe next year. But check out that video because you can achieve a color like this too by dyeing it. If you didn't know that you could dye a synthetic wig, now you know. Let me know how you feel about this wig in the comments down below. I really like her. Let me know if you like her too. How do you feel about the style? How do you feel about this color, the length? Just let me know in a comment down below. As I always say, I love when y'all talk to me. I just love engaging with you guys. Make sure you drop a comment. And if you haven't already, make sure you subscribe to my channel. I have lots of videos coming up for November and December. I'm super excited for the holidays, so you don't want to miss it. Click that notification bell as well. $20 Tuesdays is on and popping. I appreciate everyone who's been tuning in every Tuesday. Of course, I have other videos that drop other times of the week, but Tuesday is like the consistent day. You can always expect a video from me on a Tuesday. I also normally post like on a Thursday, sometimes Friday. It just depends. <laughs> I normally post maybe two to three times a week. So that's why it's so important to turn on that notification bell. That's about it, you guys. Let me know what you think in the comments and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.